Welcome to Lent at 11. We are in day 19 of our Lenten journey and we've been looking at a various passage today. We look at Mark 1, 9 to 15. One day Jesus came from Nazareth in Galilee and John baptised him in the Jordan River. As Jesus came up out of the water, he saw the heavens splitting apart and the Holy Spirit descending on him like a dove. And a voice from heaven said, You are my dearly loved son, and you bring me great joy. The Spirit then compelled Jesus to go into the wilderness, where he was tempted by Satan for 40 days. He was out among the wild animals, and angels took care of him. Later on, after John was arrested, Jesus went into Galilee, where he preached God's good news. The time promised by God has come at last, he announced. The kingdom of God is near. Repent of your sins and believe the good news. Our daily thought for today, repentance. Lent is for turning towards God. The biblical word for this turning is repentance. This was the central mission and message of the Old Testament prophets as they repeatedly called Israel to return to God. Jesus too in his very first sermon he preached invited people to repent. His parables are also full of the invitation. Sadly our turning towards God often only happens superficially. Real repentance on the other hand involves serious changes in our lives. And hopefully during this Lent we will turn more fully towards God. We can be sure that as we do we will experience the life God wants to give us like never before. So our daily practice and thought for today as we pray to the Lord, as we ask the Lord to help us to turn our whole lives towards him, what are your dominant thoughts and feelings about actually doing this? Would you like to turn more deeply to God? Are you aware of any resistances? Share these thoughts and feelings with God today as honestly as you are able and listen also to what God may want to say to you. Take care, God bless, and have a good day.